This is CHS TV. Good morning, Cathedral. I'm Nicole. And I'm Sheridan with your morning announcements for Wednesday, October 2nd, which happens to be Nicole's birthday. <laughs> oh, are we starting? Okay. <laughs> if you're looking for an exciting and unique way to be a part of Cathedral, you should consider joining the Diversity Ambassadors this year. Help Cathedral celebrate our fantastic diversity by sharing your culture and language. New members are always welcome. Join the Diversity Ambassadors on Monday, October 7th, after school in room 328 to find out more about this exciting group. Thanks for Ms. Craig, Madame Morrison, and Ms. Fitzpatrick. There will be an Astronomy Club meeting tomorrow after school at 310 in room 308. All are welcome to attend. No experience is required. You will be embarking on a virtual journey of the heavens as you learn how to recognize and navigate the stars and constellations in preparation for your first stargazing field trip next week. Bring a pencil and eraser, and don't forget to bring your signed permission forms. Grade 12 students, don't forget that there is a list of colleges and universities that will be visiting Cathedral in the coming months. The following schools will be visiting Cathedral in the next two weeks. Laurier University, Western University, and King's College. If you are interested in hearing about any of these schools, you must sign up on the sheets in the guidance office. Also in guidance, you can pick up an information sheet that explains how to apply to college or university. The application dates will be here before you know it, so be prepared. All IEC Mighty Entrepreneurship Program participants are meeting today at 315 in room 206. Snacks will be provided, but please bring a notebook. If you think you'd be interested in finding out ways to become an entrepreneur, you are welcome to attend. However, spots are limited. Attention all yearbook members. Don't forget about your meeting today after school in room 313. If you are unable to attend, please see Ms. Stoikos or Mr. Bolivia sometime today. And speaking of yearbooks, you, if you haven't picked yours up yet, you can do so on your lunch in the main office. Remember to bring photo identification. On October 16th, Cathedral celebrates academic excellence at our annual Academic Awards evening. If you received an invitation, please return your reply card by Thursday, October 10th. Please return it to Ms. Van Veen in room 325, Ms. Tabone in room 326, or the main office. The CHS Healthy Action Team, or HAT, is looking for new and previous student members who would like to join this year's committee. HAT is a youth leadership committee within our school, working to promote physical, mental, and emotional well-being in the school community. If you are interested, please sign up with Mr. Lawler in the attendance office. Your first meeting will be Monday, October 7th at 3.15 p.m. The next board game club meeting will be held tomorrow at 3 o'clock in room 337. Members may also check the schedule posted outside of room 337 for future club meeting dates. Thank you for Mr. LaRock. Students attending the CBC Much Music and Ryerson University trip today are to meet in the chapel by 9.10 a.m. Please be prompt and have everything you will need for today's trip. You will board the bus shortly after your meeting. There is a Culture of Life meeting today in room 300 after school. Your first event is Life Chain on Sunday and your permission forms are due today to Ms. Craig. Also today, the Gale Guides will be meeting in room 303 right after school. You must speak to myself if you cannot attend. And speaking of Gale Guides, later this week there will be, they will be in the forum with Cuts for Cancer sign-up sheet. Moving into sports, does anyone have a broom we could borrow? We just have to sweep up BR's dust off the ground because all three girls basketball teams beat BR right here at Cathedral last night. The Midget girls played an outstanding game and won 54-38. to Great defense by everyone. Big boards by Alexis Dunk and Brianna Birori Bir played amazing offense taking shots one after another. Great game girls, well done. Be proud of yourselves. The junior girls also played an outstanding game as a team. Every girl played amazing defense, played as a team, and had fun while they won against BT 58-35. to Great offense rebounds by Kim Rosos, who scored 19 points, and Kiana Collins-Williams, who scored 18 points. Great game, girls. There's no practice for both the junior and midget teams this evening, but there will be a brief meeting in the chapel right after school. Last night, the senior girls basketball team completed the sweep as they dominated the Bishop Ryan Celtics. The Gales took the lead early in the game, shared it a few times, but never looked back in the fourth quarter. Veteran guard Amani Abakar had a standout game with eight three-pointers, bringing her just shy of 30 points. 
excellent hustle, and defense was seen by a newcomer, Amy Nguyen and Naya Gathoth. Katrina Colin Samuels added 10 points, and Tasha e. Williams made her presence known on the boards. What a fabulous game had by all. The girls take on Bishop Tonus this Thursday. You are encouraged to go out and support your gales. Ladies, practice resumes at 3 p.m. this evening. Thanks from coaches Vesprini and Thomason. Today in field hockey, Cathedral plays Cardinal Newman. Game is at 4.15 at the Sackville Field. Teachers, please allow players to be dismissed at 1.30 p.m. Meet in front of the main office once you have changed into your uniform. Captain Sarah Carrero has directions to the new field. If there are any students interested in being on the swim team who missed yesterday's meeting, please see Ms. Lucier in the co-op office this week or next week to sign up and get a parent permission form. Swim practices begin on October 15th. And lastly, there is an important boys baseball meeting in room 313 before practice after school today. Thanks from Mr. Bolivia. Bellavia. <laughs> and those are all of your announcements for today, Cathedral. Have a great day, Gales, and thanks for watching.